I, I'm Mike Birds, doing the Pennine Trail, and I started at Southport, uh, headed all the way through Liverpool, which was an easy path. A couple of days later, it's got plenty of scenery, not so much traffic, and it it's really is tranquil. I, I like that bit. Yeah. All right, now this is a special bike. People will pay hundreds, fifteen pounds. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, carry a spare tire and punch uh, and repair gear with me, and uh, a couple of changes of clothes. That's my uh, gear for the trip. Jill, I'm a cyclist, I'm a Sustrans volunteer ranger and I'm up here to have a good time for about 10 days fortnight cycling along the uh, Pennine Cycle Trail which at this point coincides with the Trans Pennine Trail. My name is Frank, uh, I'm originally from Chicago but I've washed up in Kent. I've been a cyclist for the last 55 years or so and I'm not about to stop yet. Um, this is a wonderful trail so far, and we're having a wonderful time. It's flat. And the surface is not bad. A bit muddy, but pretty smooth. Do come. Um, it's a wonderful ride. Uh, it's good for you, so I can highly recommend it. Mike Woodmansey, I'm group coordinator for the Trans Pennine Trail from Humber Bridge to Hornsey. In the Trans Pennine Trail from Liverpool, well, Southport back to Hornsey, and we're having a, a very good time. We've got Glenn. Hi. Janet. Hi. Sean, Bob Hi. and Paul. Hello. Better cycling day today, it's cooler, cooler, much cooler, yes. Flat. Flat yeah. scenery. Down, downhill, mm. that nice. downhill. 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 <laughs> downward gradient, I think. Uh, Up the top. <laughs> 